To access Microsoft Teams, you have a few different options depending on the device you are using. If you are on a PC or a Windows 10 laptop or even a Mac, you are able to launch the desktop version of Microsoft Teams, or you can go to office.com and sign in to Office 365 in order to launch from the Teams app. Keep in mind that if you are working on a Chromebook, you would go to office.com or from any Office 365 app using the app launcher menu, you can launch Microsoft Teams by clicking on the Teams app. You can also open a new tab and go to teams.microsoft.com. You might be prompted to sign in with your district email address and password, but you will be launched into Microsoft Teams. Now, if you are using a mobile device, such as an iPad or on your Android or iOS mobile phone, you can install the free Microsoft Teams app and have most of the functionality of Microsoft Teams on your mobile device. For the Teams challenge, we will primarily be working from the desktop app of Microsoft Teams. But I encourage you to try using Teams from a wide variety of devices. All right, welcome to Microsoft Teams. Notice that Microsoft Teams has an updated view of your Teams when you click on the Teams app in the left navigation. Now you see your Teams as tiles and each of these tiles is actually movable, so you can reorder your teams to how you would like them. Notice when we launch inside a team, we'll just go into our 30-day challenge team. When you're in tile view, you only see inside the team you've selected. Let's go back to all teams. Keep in mind that you can click on the three dots up top here next to join or create team. This is the more options menu. And here you can switch the view back to the original list view. When in the original list view, now you see all of your teams in this center panel with the join or create team button at the bottom of the screen. If you wish to switch the view back, you simply come down to the bottom, join or create team, click on the three dots for more options and click switch view to grid.